about what we're here to do at Forethought, it's not just about the technology. When we think about what we do, we call it human-centered AI because it's always about humans. It's about how we interact with businesses as, as customers or employees or otherwise. Forethought is really here to accelerate that, to bring intelligence and efficiency and make people's lives better and not have to be put on hold every time they have a really important question. We're on that tip of the iceberg where people are starting to realize how impactful this can be. And I think that drives us every day. And what's really, really rewarding is seeing how happy and how much we have changed our customers' lives. The capacity for AI to impact lives in a positive way is, is uh, I don't think we've even come close to the potential that, uh, that's available to us. With natural language understanding techniques that we're using, we can really help our AI agent to better understand the intent behind the questions that a customer may be asking. And you know, our customers are seeing results. They're seeing over a 90% accuracy in ticket resolution. And at the same time, they're seeing over 20% increase in agent efficiency. And you know, being human-centered AI, we want to focus on the human experience across the world. And that's why recently we've actually expanded this to include over 100 languages supported by Forethought's AI. Humans are very good at processing a lot of data. But we're very good at looking at outcome and make difficult decisions. Machine learning, AI, uh, if you think about it, is great at processing lots and lots of data. And so imagine a world where if you can take the best of both worlds, where the machine crunches the data, we make the decision. That's huge. I think it's an important distinction to make that AI doesn't solve every problem. A lot of problems shouldn't be solved by AI, and it's important to be able to tell the difference between something that maybe we can handle automatically, something that needs a human touch, and something that maybe needs some extra information for the agent to use, but still does require a human touch. We know that a chatbot can't solve all of our customers' issues. When a customer has a more deep or maybe more complex issue, we take that issue and we route it to the right support agent using our triage technology. And once that ticket gets to the right support agent, we want to make sure that agent feels empowered. So we empower them with the right resources, the right knowledge, so that they feel confident, prepared to really be able to solve our customers' issues. My true North Star as a forethinker is to be able to navigate through multiple different websites, knowing that I can get my answers timely and accurately because I can see the Forethought logo across all of them. Well, I look forward to the day when Forethought become that layer of intelligence that powers the enterprise, regardless which function, and it becomes the technology that makes the human interaction that much better, that much more efficient, and truly unlock human potential. It makes me happy to help other people. And at the end of the day, I feel good leaving knowing that somebody had a good experience if I had to say one thing to everybody listening, I would say this. Think outside the bot.